So, um, yes, one of my favorite things this month was my dog. And he's not month, he's year round. He's so, so he's gonna be in this video because he was whimpering and he's cold. <laughs> um, so first I'm gonna do a Bath and Body Works, which if you didn't know, two days ago, I think two days ago, they had a sale. It was three dollars a thing, which is amazing. So first, I thought I ran out of toys and peppermint. Sorry, I'm <laughs> and I got the lotion. It's amazing. It smells like peppermint but a little bit sweeter um next lotion i got which i have i have never gotten it i've heard such great things about it then wham i got it and it's, oh my gosh, it's amazing it's it's a beautiful day and it smells like a beautiful day like it's amazing um it smells like a fruity smell so if you don't like fruity smells i don't suggest getting it Suggest just getting something like cherry blossom that's toned down but this one, that smell? <laughs> smells like apple. I love apples too. So matching to my first lotion, I got the Twisted Peppermint Room Spray. So when it comes around to Christmas time, because right now it's November, I'm just going to spray this around my room and it's going to smell so good. Okay. And then one that I like better than Twisted Peppermint is Fresh Balsam. Can I smell it? <laughs> Fresh Balsam just smells like when you're sending up your Christmas tree and it smells so good that's exactly what it smells like and so next which I always get them confused Bath and Body Works and the body shop I have <laughs> I have um these two little body butters which I've never heard before your ears flapped <laughs> and this one is coconut I love a good coconut smell and as you can see you stick don't like it. And this one is, I really can't pronounce it, it's Bure Corporatel. It looks like that. And it smells so good. I've never heard of it. I don't even think it's real. But as you can see, I used a lot of it. And it smells so good. Puppy. Oh. Um, that's the only things I got from the body shop. Next place is CVS. <laughs> So when I go and I don't have that much money in my wallet and I want makeup that's cheap, I go to CVS. But their makeup is cheap, but it can be exp as expensive as some Sephora products. So I look for the high-end, more expensive brands, which is NYX. And I love NYX. So from NYX, I got this natural NYX palette. It The colors in here are so pretty and they're so... um like glittery I really love it it came with the brush but I threw it out because it was an ugly blush it didn't smell like that and it's really pretty colors um it was $12 which is really good for makeup and then I also got a matte soft cream lip it's basically like if you go to Sephora and you go to Benefit I think it's the melted it's basically the same thing the only thing that I don't like about it is that it's um, a very vibrant color, and I will swatch it for you. It's very vibrant, but it is really buttery and soft. I've never worn it because I'm too scared to wear it to school because I won't look good. I'll just, I won't look good. And then when I was at CVS, I looked at When Wild, which I really usually don't do because it's really cheap and really not great quality quality but it was so cheap that i was like you know what, i'll just get it so i got two things that i love so first i got concealer because my concealer is running out and it's um i got actually three but um this one's a little darker i wish i got a lighter color i would swatch it but you can't really see it it's right there you can't really see it but it is really it's really good at blending if you're using a beauty blender it can really blend they have all shades, and then this is better than any NARS, any Sephora, any Benefit, anything, any MAC, and it's $2. So instead of saving up on buying like a $120 or $60 thing, because it's $2, all you need is a beauty blender, which is $20, and it's so good. It's like, 
I've been wearing it recently, and no one said that I looked orange, which they have last year. <laughs> Let's just leave it at that. So, I went to Sephora recently, and it was a grand opening at the Stanford Mall, and I got a few things. <laughs> so, I got two NARS um, lipsticks, which were pretty expensive, but they came for, like, the birthday thing, so I got them for free. So I gave them to my sister because I don't really wear lipstick. But then I got something for $12, which is really good at Sephora. And I used to have a routine for mascaras where I, like, used seven different mascaras because my eyelashes are really short. Then this morning when I used this first, my eyelashes were long and I only used one thing and I saved, like, 20 minutes of doing makeup. And it is waterproof, too, and it's only $12. It's so pretty, and there's so much, um, product in it, and if you can, if you want to see, the brush is, like, really skinny, so it does get on every individual, individual eyelash. Here. Then I went over to the Benefit, which is my favorite, and I got the There Real, I, this is my second one, or third, third one, and it is so good. Um, the brush has a it's kind of weird it's kind of fluffy on the tip tip it has like a little thing so, so you can do your bottom lashes and it's so good and this is probably my favorite i can go anywhere and just take this or my other one and then i'm set and sometimes when i do wake up a little, a little bit earlier and i feel like maybe looking better i use my makeup forever it is by Sephora. Sorry. It is by Sephora. I think this is Forever 21 brand, but I got it at Sephora. It's really weird. And then the brush looks like a caterpillar. Um, you can't eat it. Cut. See how And so it's really good. It makes your eyelashes look so good. And I only do it because, use it sometimes because it can get clumpy and I don't like when my eyelashes are clumpy. Not at all. Um, two more things. I have the Gimme Brow from Benefit. And I love anything from Benefit. And so, when I wanted to, m to make my eyelashes look bigger, I was like, I'll go to Benefit. And they have the Gimme Brow. And it is terrible. <laughs> It is amazing. I just, it takes me five seconds instead of coming up my eyebrows, doing it with a pencil, which I have. And it takes me like honestly five minutes. People have asked like, did you get your eyebrows done when honestly I have not? And then I just use this. It's amazing. So if you're wondering. And also sometimes in the morning recently, I looked at my nose or like anything and I see that I have noticeable pores so I went and I was like what can I do like just like help me <laughs> and they're like this is what you can do um this is the mini one it was like five dollars <laughs> instead of like twenty dollars so I just got it it's amazing and it smells like sunscreen but like a good sunscreen not like a bad sunscreen it's really good and I love it and he loves it too right you love it um I have one two three four five more things and so the next thing that I have is from Lush. I have seven more of these from like parties and everything. This is their bubblegum lip scrub. It is vegan if you're wondering if you're vegan. Um, it is not animal tested which I love because do not look up what animal testing is. It's bad. You'll be scarred. <laughs> and it, what you do you probably like well, what is that? It's basically flavored sugar. You put it on your lips. And you rub them together. Lick it off. And then your lips are so soft. It is amazing. Why is this like? <laughs> and it's so soft and it's so good. And I used to bring them to school and everyone would ask me. So I don't bring them anymore. Because I used to run out. Um, so... Next thing, I think I might need two hands for it. So, bye bye. So, my next thing is a wallet. I got this one from Charlotte Russe. 
for I think twelve dollars. And I love like the the fabric I guess. But I do not like the zipper, so my dad's gonna tap it off. Um I love the little things. Amazing. But the inside has so many pockets and then there's a little thing with money, which I never really can find in wallets, but this one's amazing and it has it. Um so my next wallet is this Louis Vuitton wallet. Um whenever I see someone on Tumblr on Pinterest that has a Louis Vuitton item, they put a sticker on it and it looks so cute, so I had to do it and I got the sticker. And then it just has like credit cards and stuff in it. Where's my money? Okay. So this I love this wallet. I usually don't bring it anywhere because I don't like how people kind of like say like, oh, she's sports and she's like the Louis Vuitton. It's just not really that nice. And then I got it about a month ago, but I love it. I don't know what they say. Everyone has one of these stickers. Um, along with that, I have three stickers that are really, really cool that I love. So two of them are from Brandon Melville, and then this is one that I got from Rams. So I saw that Nash Beer on his laptop. He has like these messily, like like five thousand of them on his computer. So I thought I'll put one on my computer. So I did, and then I got another pair of Rams, and I have them for anyone. So if you want a sticker, just ask me. I'll give it to you. Then I have the Brandy Melville, which I actually have my on my computer right now. And can you not? And I just love this one because it's just really cool. It's really simple, too. And then the one that you probably saw in my wallet. Little Snapchat thingy. Um, and my last thing is really cheesy. You'll be okay. And it is a Polaroid camera. I got this about three months ago. But I love it because I have three stacks of Polaroid camera pictures over there. I have about 300 pictures. Um... I love it. It was only $70, and I got mine from Michaels, and if you're, you really want one, get it from Michaels, because they always 